BHS student athletes putting pen to paper to make their college dreams come true. And as always, it was a special moment for all in the room to witness these seniors soak up this memorable moment. A crowd gathered on campus to celebrate these soon to be collegiate athletes, as well as coaches and family members supporting their bright futures. Antoine Thompson, he's going to be playing football at Bethel College in Kansas, getting a hug from his mama there. While his teammate Keontae Bell will also continue his football career at Fair State University in Michigan. He had some kind words for his coach and his coach right back at him and Andrew Blomhoff he's gonna stay on or stay home to wrestle at Cal State Bakersfield we'll be excited to see him here in town on the mats and then Morgan, Morgan Wilkie she's gonna continue her softball career in Nebraska at Peru State College and the track star for the drillers Kennedy McCall she signed with Cal State Fullerton as she looks forward to pursuing her dreams on the track I know like I had a lot of other big schools after me, but it was just one of those schools that really spoke out to me the most and somewhere I could see myself for the next four to five years. I'm super excited. Like it's such a blessing to be able to say like I've made it and now I can go on to the next level. So I'm just really excited. I'm ready for the next chapter. One of those schools was USC as McCall has made the most of her high school career, but she's going to be putting her talent at Cal State Fullerton. But she also had a recent leg injury that sidelined her so for the season. But so far, she's already made a major impact, hitting two PRs on March 30th in the West Coast Relays. You're seeing that now running a 2496 in the 200 and a 5461 in the 400. That's the race you're watching as she currently sits as fifth best in the state. But my goal was to just get a 55, you know, go out there and just my, run my race. You know, it's my race, just take control. And um, I went out there, and when I crossed the line, and I, I looked up, and it said, Can you call 54-6? I'm like, oh, my gosh. Like, it was crazy. We just want to wish her well. You know, we're going to miss her. I hate seeing her go. I'm glad to see her going and getting what she deserves to get. And I hope that it's a continued testament to what we're all about. We talk about scholarships and championships in whatever order they come, and she's had both. Well, Kennedy, she's battling in physical therapy right now to return to the track ahead of the state meet at the end of the month. We hope to see her there, but she, of course, has made her mark here in Bakersfield and has so much ahead of her on the track, wishing her all the best in that recovery. Well, we had plenty of athletes signing not only today, but this week over at Frontier. Seven Titans put pen to paper today, signing to continue their softball and baseball careers. And the Garces seniors, Alexis Green and Isaiah Hughes, they signed to continue their basketball careers in college. And over at Stockdale, 12 athletes earlier this week breaking some records signed to compete in college in a variety of sports. We want to wish all those student athletes and those who didn't highlight the best of luck at the next level and beyond.